Merci d'assister à notre euh, conférence de presse aujourd'hui. Uh, thank you for coming. Pour moi et le Parti vert, il est très important que nous assurions que les enfants développent leur plein potentiel. Mais trop d'enfants qui vont à l'école qui ont faim. Donc, le Parti vert va faire un, un investissement de fournir un programme de nourriture euh, de plusieurs de l'école. We are going to end it. Today, more and more teachers are at the end of their rope. No matter what they do in terms of preparing the very best lessons for their classes, too many children are attending who are hungry and therefore cannot learn. So the Green Party of New Brunswick is committed to investing considerable money into our schools so that every children, every child will be well fed and therefore attain, achieve their full potential to learn. We will spend $15 million to ensure that there are meal programs in each school in this province and wellness programs so that our children can learn and so that our teachers can teach. And that money will be raised with a tax on sugar sweetened drinks. And that will raise $15 million that will go directly into our schools. It's time to invest in our schools, invest in our students. And that money will also help ensure that the inclusion program is properly implemented and that the resources are there uh, to ensure teachers can well handle uh, the inclusion policy, which is a good policy, but the resources just have never put in place to ensure that it is properly implemented. This speaks to the need to have teachers uh, at the center of decision making around uh, what happens in our schools. So the Green Party would put teachers uh, at the center. It's very important to faire a lot of consultations with the enseignants in our school when there are the possibilities of new politics uh, of education. It's not the reality now, but it's il to be the devenu reality to develop the politics in the system of education in New Brunswick. The, the reorganization of the school districts, the consolidation of the school districts have been a disaster. We need to bring decision making back closer to the community, back closer to the teachers, so that students and teachers are at the center of every decision that has been made. So we would look carefully at how we could uh, restore uh, local decision making in the school system that was taken away when school boards were amalgamated across this province. Thanks very much for coming. And now, des questions?